welcome back to another episode and today we've come to Burley House for the Rolls Royce and Bentley Bentley Classic Car Rally Annual Rally we've been to Bentley at Bentley Burley House Burley House it's Bentley, Bentley house. well it's the, it's the Rolls Royce and Bentley show isn't it yeah I'm getting confused but we've been to Burley House before and you can see that video put a little card up here but for now we're going to dive in and have a look around these classic cars. Hmm. So these are all, it says class 20s and class 19. I don't know what that means, but no, it's all it's these just here. The parking spots. Yeah, there's all these here. I think these are like the more modern ones. Look. Maybe they get older as they go in class. What do you think? They might easily do. But we'll have a little wander up here though, because they are quite nice cars. Look. Oh. Look at these. That's nice. Isn't it? Beautiful. They just look premium. Yeah. Yeah, I'm off. What do you think of that one? Very nice. Yeah. Very, very long. Because it's long and black. <laughs> oh, yeah. We all get to have a ride in one of them, look. Don't we? Yeah, some sooner than others. Especially if I keep making comments like that. Indeed. This is an unusual colour for a Bentley, isn't it? No, it's a more modern one, though. Mm -hmm. Nice brakes on it, look. Nice. Smell the leather on that. Creators. Gotta clean the flies off it though, look. Come a long way though since the, the boxy days, haven't they? Look, that's a Rolls Royce though, but. Wonder if we'll get copyrighted for that music. Maybe. Look at this. Phantom one. Hey, Kath, can talk about it? Hey, oh, look. They used to strap the wing mirror to the tyre, look. How did that work? What do you mean, how did it work? Wheel did on that, didn't you? You no, That's just... the spare wheel, you donk. <laughs> Wheel's down there. Oh my god. <laughs> Should I talk about it? No, I don't. Thank you. <laughs> That's just the toolkit, then, is it? Clearly. It the is. Toolkit. Well, yeah, we we'll go in the side step. This Bentley is just lush. It's lovely. Yeah, it's the same as that funny coloured one. Yeah, back there, but with, it's not. It's I think not this the one's. Same. Yeah, look. You just bury yourself in there, don't you? Yeah. What's this one, Mum? This is more suited to you, Kath. Yeah. What? They're attached, they're not on the wheel. Yeah, it's got a little, a little carpet in it. It's like a little house carpet inside. Some headlights on that lot. <laughs> Have a look around that one. Oh, yeah. This is the, the thing with old cars that have got leather seats, is keeping the leather healthy, isn't it? Yeah, not entirely sure what model this is. We've snuck in. We, we've snuck in. <laughs> it's not, not be the first time I've snuck in the back door. Oh my God. But we've snuck in to the, to the members area. I spoke to a guy. I don't know why I'm saying that quietly. Like, so he, no one hears us. I spoke to a guy and he says that no one will probably challenge us in that, so we've snuck in. So let's have a look around here, isn't it? 
Yeah, if anyone does, we'll just say we're looking for the tent where you pay. <laughs> that old chest up. <clears throat> so this is where you come for your technical advice, apparently. I wonder how much the front grill would cost you on one of these. Uh, I wouldn't have that to add. Technical advice. See, the leather on there looks in a lot better condition for the age of the car, doesn't it? Mm. That's because they've got the technical advice. It's what? £85,000. Shall we buy it and then we can be in? We'll be in the club. You don't want that, I haven't got the wheels. Yeah. But that's, that's obviously they've been showing someone some technical advice. That's what would happen if that was in our street. <laughs> We've just got a, a new yeah, car, this brand is new. Sale. 14 miles on the clock. Parked it in the street. Two days later, noticed someone's running the back of it and not told us. Nice one. Now that's your SUV, isn't it? Huh? Scan that QR code, see what it says about it. Things move on, innit? What do you think? Indeed. Oh. Very nice. Very nice to meet you. Thank you very much. Have a no good problem. Good day. Should we go and buy one? Yeah, what up on that showroom bit? Yeah. No. That's not. <laughs> wow. Yeah, that's a nice motor, isn't it? That, yeah, I'm Googling that one. That is nice. That is nice. That is not your typical showroom. Mm, well, I mean, it's a mobile showroom, isn't it, that? Like? Well, yeah, but it's more beautiful than... Yeah. Yeah, less is more on the back end of these. Please make your way to the electric ring as soon as you can. Immediate journey to the electric ring. Frames up. Dogs are loose, the drain's up. Yeah, the first thing you need to buy before you buy Rolls Royce is uh, a funny pulled pair of trousers and throw away all your socks. And uh, like a Trilby type hat as well, by the looks of it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we wear a slightly different part of the, of the boss part of the part. So this is still bid only auction. Um, so uh, Like restored or something, are they? Still bid only. I don't know what that means, really. Well, it's not like an open auction where people stand in a room going, so it's sticking their hand up. Not your style of auction then, is it? Uh, huh? No. Huh? I like the the brass. You know what I mean? Mm. I like the mechanical bits of the handbrake. I like that a lot. If you was heavily into steampunk, these are the cars for you, aren't they? Bentley 3 litre. Racing one more. Is that British Racing Green then, do you think? Not like a racing car, does it? But it was in its day. It's still driven about today. So is it? Yeah, by the original owner's daughters. Daughters? Excellent. 
What's that say? Rolls Royce and Bentley motor cars. P and A Wood. Bentley S3 Continental. The thing is with these um, with these old style cars, it's older is sometimes better. You say it's not very impressive, but some of the old ones are a bit like, you know, people would rather have them really. I mean, even the car salesmen look different to your normal, like. That's what I mean. Look, and it's like people shopping for antiques and stuff, isn't it? Mm. Right, this one. See, it looks, it's a lot older on the outside, but I think that's been refurbed or something, hasn't it? Surely. I won't have a clue. Yeah, look. This is nice. I if Rolls Royce will ever come out with, like, electric cars. <laughs> Oh, yeah. I'm not keen on the orange stripe. You're not? No. The orange stripe, yeah, it doesn't really suit the car, does it? But it's got it's got yellow piping around the seats yeah, a lot. I see that. Yeah, but they're just very minimalistic around the back end though, aren't they? I like that. Royce Phantom 3, 1937. You can smell it old inside, like an old war museum. Phantom 2. People are worried about them, you know. Mm. Um, they get sort of Roy's Silver Wraith. They're just massive, aren't they? Mm. What year was this then? 1953, look. That'd be something like the, the Queen got in or something, wouldn't it? That. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's very much put the screen up at the back lot. And they sat in the back, and the driver had to sit in the open. Yeah. It's like an armchair in the back, isn't it? Yeah. <coughs> yeah, but that's that's uh, like how the society was in them days, though, wasn't it? Mm. Wouldn't have had a driver sat in with them. Calf. Nature's head. That'd do for the camper, wouldn't it? When we do it. <laughs> it's like a proper throne. Yeah. Pump action for when you've done your pump. Get some spare parts. I suspect this will be copyrighted. It's going to get copyrighted. Bloody Ness and Dorma. Blurring out. Yeah. There you go. What's this one? Rolls Royce. 20 horsepower, 1926. Will be. Half a million pound car. They've stuck the, uh, the modern in between two classics. Look. Come on, Mr. Black. Look at what they're wearing, looking at the car. Oh? This is hilarious. Yeah. So we've got a winner's parade. 
It's obviously some sort of show, isn't it? In some sort of show competition. I've seen some and, uh, judges. Have you? What? Yeah. So uh, I think they're going to do a parade through the through the arena. So let's go and have a look at that. The Rolls Royce Silver Ghosts, car number five, uh, owned by Robert Vanderstam, a lovely touring car. Seen one like that before. Yeah, look at this. What's it say? Poo Nawala. Your hand Poo Nawala collection. But yeah, I don't know, this is some sort of stately one lot. Blue light on the top. Oh, they've got some wine shops glasses in the back of. Some what? Yeah, some curtains in the back there, look. Sherry glasses. No, not fucking shot glasses. Sherry glasses, then. Shot glasses. They wouldn't be used for sherry if we was in there, would they? No. Yes, my lady. So we've had enough of that now, haven't we? Yeah, it got very hot in there. Very, very hot. hot. So and a lot of the fans have run out of drinks, haven't they? Yes. So we're going to head to the cafe while it's still open. And on the way, I'm going to give you some fascinating facts about Burley House. Helicopter over there, look. For some people, Bentley's not luxurious enough, is it? So Burley House was built in the 16th century by Sir William Cecil, who was the treasurer to Queen... Elizabeth I. Elizabeth I. The house has been used for various filming locations, including none or less than the Pride and Prejudice and the Da Vinci Code. Yeah, as was Lincoln Cathedral. So Burley House has 35 major rooms on the ground and first floor, and then 80 lesser rooms with multiple halls, corridors, service areas and bathrooms in the building. Huge. The gardens were designed by Capability Brown, who's one of the most famous garden designers of time. We should get her in for ours. There are over 300 paintings in the house, including Rembrandt's. And I can't pronounce the other ones. <laughs> what do you mean you can't pronounce them? So, did you know, Burley House has its own deer park, and you can see a herd of fallow deer just roaming around freely. We might bump into them. Stroke them. <laughs> Stroke them? You'll not get near them. There's also a collection of over 2,000 books in Burley House dating back to the 16th century. That kept me busy. And the beautiful heaven room was painted by Antonio Verrio, and it took him over six years to paint. Mm? Have some light refreshments before we head home. Egg mayonnaise. Yeah, the dreaded. For anyone that knows me knows how much I love my egg mayonnaise. I'm glad the car's well rented. <laughs> So there you go, what a beautiful day. Yeah. Yeah, spent with a beautiful woman. Who? So that was Burley, Rolls Royce and Bentley classic annual oh, car rally, yeah. yeah. <coughs> and there were some lovely old cars around there, weren't there? Oh, some really good cars. You've got to have a lot of money for those. Yeah. And we snuck in. We did. <laughs> so that was a little, little bonus, wasn't it? Got some yeah. for nothing. We did, yeah. Good no pay. idea how much it would cost to get in there normally. Whoa. Even if it was a fiver though, it's just the thought that we've got away with it. Yeah. <laughs> Until someone we sees this on YouTube. Yeah. And we'll get a bill. But yeah, so that's that. We're gonna head home now. I've got the merch on today as well, by the way. See that? See you on the next one. It's tracking my face and it won't go low. There you go. See you on the next one. <laughs> so yeah, the merch shop. It's not available at the minute. <clears throat> but it'll be going up soon, so have a go at that. And also, you can now sign up to the members area, where 
I can't remember how much the, the tiers are, but there's three tiers. And you can help support the channel by signing up to one of them. And I think the Adventurers package, you can get members' videos. So that's it from Burley House. And uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and uh, click the little bell icon for future updates. And leave a comment in the comment section. We'll see you on the next one. <laughs> we'll see you on the next one.